As we say at Beijing, cancer has no borders, neither do we. There's no competitors in fighting cancer. There's only collaborators. Today is a really special day for me and for Beijing and for our team. It's the culmination of years of work from our dedicated colleagues. And now we're breaking ground on the flagship U.S. Manufacturing Center. The initial construction of the Hopewell R&D and Manufacturing Center will include 400,000 square feet of biologic manufacturing space, which will make it one of the largest biofarm projects in the U.S. And it'll have AI and state-of-the-art virtual capabilities that'll make it one of the most advanced facilities of its kind anywhere in the world. We're eager to get started, so our first permit was approved uh, earlier this week and we expect to be excavating this property later this week or early next week. We fully embrace the future. Beijing is a big part of that future and we are thrilled to welcome you to our community. Beijing is investing in this community. That will mean jobs, that will mean new opportunities, but it will also be New Jersey's return to its historical role as a center for innovation, not only for the United States, but across the world. It's about making sure our medicines are affordable and attainable for anybody, no matter where they're at. It's in having the U.S. as a strong presence and just being a part of the global network. I'm not just a cancer survivor, but I lost my mother and my father to cancer. So when you talk about cancer and we talk about the complexity of cancer, it really is important to me to see the kind of investment that we make in those areas. We wear your presence in our state as a badge of honor, period. When we look in the mirror, we see companies like Beijing. So on behalf of the state of New Jersey, this is a big, big day in the Garden State. We wish Beijing nothing but many decades of great success and growth in this great state to meeting not just some of the folks who need us, but all of them. Thank you all.